Hello friend, in today's lesson, I will uh, teach you how to show the FSMO role ownership could not be verified as you see in this mistake. Okay, this one uh, can be caused by duplication. This can be uh, DC2 fail, okay, or DC1 fail, and then it will be alert this mistake. So you need to go and configure it uh, manually. So first you need to go to your server nature. Now I'm on DC1. Okay, I go to server nature and I go to active black list science and service. Okay. So uh, here is my uh, active black list science service events. Okay. I expand it and then I go to site. Okay. The full site server okay so i have uh two server one is dc1 domain my domain controller primary domain controller and i have dc2 secondary domain controller so to show this okay i go to secondary domain controller and i uh, right click and choose replicate now okay now active directory domain service has been replicated so now I go to Active Directory um, Active Directory Administrative uh, Center to enable the resources called bin for the Active Directory So I go here and then I click Enable Reset Call Bin uh, The purpose of uh, Enable Reset Call Bin is to uh, restore unexpected or uncoincidentally delete user or you or group uh, by us yeah okay so we can restore it now I need to click ok ok so they ask us please refresh at uh, AD administrative center now ok now refresh ok so uh, when you see this our uh, mm, this is a Corbin has been enabled. Okay, so uh, for the main purpose of this video is I want to show you on how uh, we this we uh, resolve or solve on the FSMO uh, problem when you install service or when you do anything it alerts this mistake. Okay, so that's all for today's lesson. See you in the next video.